I fell in love with a Scorpio. It's a crazy story though. She was super pretty, the baddest in my portfolio. She was super sweet, I would eat her up like a Oreo. I don't know how I got her, I'm giving God all the glory though. And she was born in October or November. I really cannot remember. I hope it doesn't offend her. She told me that she loved me because I was so sweet and tender. And I would always defend her. And I was not a pretender. <laughs> but one day she was acting so mysterious. I was curious, and honestly, I was furious. Wasn't talking to me, she really had me delirious. I was overthinking, I didn't know she was serious. I thought maybe she had found somebody else but honestly she told me she was working on herself she took some time off to focus on her mental health and i had to accept it regardless of how i felt huh. but all in all what i learned in the end is i love scorpios i swear scorpios are 10 but be careful because as soon as you get in what the biggest turn... macro trade of all time is it's crypto going from 2.7 trillion where we are today to let's say 12 trillion by the end of this cycle and on to 100 trillion within 10 years and you've got to understand, this would be the fastest accumulation of an asset class in all recorded history in the shortest period of time. It'll have driven the highest returns of any asset class in all of recorded history in the shortest period of time. In fact, in any period of time. It will be the fastest accumulation of wealth the world has ever seen in the shorter period of time. What's up, y'all? This is 1028 Awakenings, and I am back again with another motherfucking video. I'm trying to drop two an hour at the same time, so keep up with me, okay? Because I got to catch up, you know? Miss a day of work, and they already trying to clock in there, you know what I'm saying? So what's going on, Scorpios? I hope y'all looking good, feeling good, and motherfucking smell good. Let's see what's crowning a reading <clears throat> for my Scorpios, all right? We were really talking about wealth, man. I can't believe on the last three of my birthday came out. I'm like, damn, okay? That's kind of heavy. Scorpios, make sure y'all not letting anything distract y'all. Try to stay focused, okay? Stay focused, man. Stay focused. Damn, this keep coming out. I keep avoiding it. It just keep doing it. 28, man. I try to shuffle so many times, all right? So money, stability, success, joy achievements okay so you your your personal power is being activated a lot of you guys are going to receive a lot of recognition achievement joy love passion growth expansion some of you guys are going to be worldwide it's going to be the end to people hiding their emotions you got infinite possibilities and this is all because you took a chance okay it was an elaborate maze, okay? This shit could have been hella fucking difficult. You didn't know where the fuck you was going. You never really had a mark, you know what I'm saying? You just knew you had to get there. And I think that whatever obstacle you took, even if you ran into a wall, Scorpio, you still did what you needed to do. 15, 19, <clears throat> 43, 23, 31, 8, 39, all right? 28, crowning a read. All right, 28th is the number of wealth, and we all know that. Now, that, if, it was, if it's one thing we know, we know what the fuck 28 means, okay? You could be seeing 28 a lot of places, maybe even 228, okay, Scorpios? Just let you know, all right? You have went through a huge transformation, and you know this, all right? I'm hearing, and you know this, man, all right? So, Scorpio, something is bringing you a lot of joy. You came a long way, all right? But you took a risk on yourself. You took a bet, and that was the best risk you could have ever taken. Your possibilities are endless. This is the year of the dragon, and your possibilities is riding with you, okay? Um, we do have a full moon coming up. I am going to do a podcast on that. If you guys want to listen to my podcast, it's 1028 Awakenings, and it's on Apple um you know itunes uh google play just look it up okay scorpio your voice is gonna be going worldwide i don't know what the fuck you're gonna be doing but everybody's gonna know your name <laughs> okay and you're gonna fall in love now this is nice because this card has eight on it so it's gonna be a love that's reciprocated and it's also gonna be a love that's gonna last a very long time now you and this person could be very very goofy because when you drain a balloon and you suck the air out of them you have a like squeaky voice and you're very playful so you and this person could get along very well but y'all could play y'all could both also really like holidays okay with this balloon here this also signifies you know valentine's day so you and this person could really like celebrating your birthday or this person could be big on birthdays or something like that all right scorpio a lot of your achievements bring you a lot of joy you're going to be personally crowned by your audience personally crowned 
by your employees or your peers here, okay, because of your achievements here. And a lot of people love what you do. You put a smile on a lot of people's face. And this could just be you going to work acting like a silly little person, all right? And people love that about you, all right? So let me see what the scoop is for my Scorpios. Damn, that was quick. All right, so we got Tarot Card Reader, okay, right out the gate. So you could be telling people what you do for work, okay? And a lot of people could be like, what the fuck do you do? Okay. Um, someone could be getting readings on you. You could introduce this world to someone and they go and get readings from other people. Okay. But, you know, your your personal power has been activated. You have a lot of joy in your life. You have a lot of achievements in your life. And it could have something to do with you doing tarot. You know, tarot could pay your way to do a lot of different things and people don't understand it. But, you know, you're doing a good thing. So you keep doing it. All right. Somebody is secretly obsessed with you, Scorpio. This is somebody who wears hoodies. All right. They do see numbers, but they act like they don't. So whoever this is, they do see angel numbers, but they try to disregard it. These angel numbers have been coming in ever since last Thanksgiving for this person. But this person is very scared of these numbers. They feel like it's a caution or they need to be scared. So they purified the energy of you, okay, or you purified your energy of them. This person is very confused with fork in the road here. This person has been working really hard at their job, okay? Um, <clears throat> and they've been staying away from you. You could be a performer, okay? Caught up. This person has done some things behind your back with someone's actions are catching up to them. Uh, they've, they've covered their tracks really good. Well, guarded here, you don't even be around this person. So it's very easy for this person to act like, you know, if you were dealing with them, that it didn't even happen because you're not a pushy person. Like, even if you were Scorpio male, you fall back with the quickness. Um, one of the attributes of this girl, if you're a Scorpio male that you like, was her ass, okay? Um, and you liked her hair, all right? So whoever this was that you was attracted to, you liked her ass and you liked her hair. But <clears throat> with guarded here in reverse, you really just didn't respond to this. Like, if this person reached out to you, you responded to them. But you never really reached out to this person because you knew something was fishy with their situation. This person is, is getting caught up. This person could have gave you something. And someone knows that this object belongs to you. You know, but somebody's like, it wasn't me. <laughs> All right. Now, you could be a performer, but people hate watching you perform. But they still watch you anyway. I'm not sure why they do that. We also have jobs. So this person is on their job, but they feel very like torn because they want to do something that they love. And then they have to do something that, you know, gives them 401k or some kind of pension here. And this is what's giving this person like different choices. This could be you too. Like how you just going to start over, you know, with no future. But if your company closes down tomorrow, isn't that the same outcome? So purifying your energy and aura. Some people could have warned this person about you. All right. And they could have told them. You need to get the fuck away from Scorpio, all right? She's talking to you about numbers. This nigga wearing tourmaline bracelets. Like, what does those black beads mean? And just know that if you don't brush your teeth, your breath stinks. So if you don't wear tourmaline bracelets or just the hand or the evil eye, you can't have people put spiritual attacks on you all the time. But if you're wise, you will wear tourmaline. If you smart, you will have some kind of protection on you. Just like, you know, like walking around smelling like homeless people and alcohol ain't cute. Okay, it's the same shit. And if you don't learn that now, please learn that, okay? Now, someone was very cautious, okay? They still wanted to be around you, Scorpio, all right? But now they're secretly obsessed with you. They watch you from a secret page, but you look really happy. You know, you in your power, you achieving things, you setting goals for yourself, whoever this is that's watching you from afar. Um, you seeing things very clearly as well, okay? All right, let's see what the karmic is doing, all right? So you could have felt like this person was fucking with somebody else. So you really wasn't all in a shit like that, whether you be a, a male or a female. Let's see what's going on between this person and, and that other person, all right? So whoever this is, somebody works at night, okay? So they work at night. This could be the dude that works at night or the girl works at night. But whoever this is, they work at nighttime, all right? So whoever this is, they come over at night. All right, what's going on with this other person? Somebody's coming over at night and they're not even interested in having sex. They just want to go to sleep. And they could be not even holding the person. So it's like, why you got this nigga coming over here? He ain't even touching you. Okay, girl, stop it. Okay, he not giving you anything either. He don't buy nothing for you. Somebody's just coming over for companionship late at night, but they're not even interested in sex. It's because they're interested in someone else, Scorpio. I feel like you could be this other woman or this other man. And they like you. They like that you read. They like that your hair is natural. But they acted like a clown, though, with your ass. Look at that clown and mask, okay? They really wish they would have took their mask off. I don't like clowns, y'all. You could have blocked this person on social media. 
tarot card readers here and y'all are separated okay you could be getting everything that you want somebody think you put a love spell on them somebody also feels like you're very materialistic they don't really know you though like people who do know you know that you're not selfish you give a lot you're not petty you're not childish and you're really loving okay but you could smoke a lot of weed you don't eat it but you smoke it and a lot of people know that okay you know exactly who you are and you tell people that okay some people don't even understand how you live this life and you don't need a job okay so some people are questioning like how you live the way you live and you don't have a job but people need to get the fuck out your face like learn from a nigga and stop talking about a nigga you know what i'm saying <laughs> all right <clears throat> very interesting here okay scorpios Sometimes you need to school a nigga. Like, come on, we'll school you. Let's see what's going on with my Scorpios and their finances, okay? So y'all thinking about traveling more? There is an opportunity for you to travel for work or business. You might be attending a vacation or, you know, just training something, but you will embrace a skill, okay? So you might be like, damn, I need to go somewhere. Spirit is telling you, yeah, go ahead and take this trip. <clears throat> Plan out some time for you to do that. Also, you're very beautiful and attractive, y'all. I'm for real. I'm really comfy. And I'm not going to pick that card up. But what this says is that your beauty is an authentic stamp as well as you being so handsome. And you can use this to margin on your property. Now, don't use no OnlyFans. I don't support OnlyFans. I mean, it's people on there that do what they do and I'm not knocking them for doing that. But I don't have an OnlyFans. Okay, so I'm just telling you there is something that you will have that only people will support you. You know what I mean? And it is because you're attractive and you look really good. So it's okay. But use this in the highest uh, light as you can. Because if you use it in a low vibrational state, it will come back to you. And it's not worth the price, okay? So, you know, don't hide <clears throat> behind the camera. Get in front of the camera. Because you're real beautiful or you're very handsome. And a lot of people like your authenticity, okay? All right. So Scorpio, also, a lot of people who were sneaky as fuck, they're gone. So if you was dealing with a lot of sneaky fucking people, they're out of your life. The sneaky fox here is here in reverse and it says watch out. So now you can kind of just chill because everybody who is sneaky or conniving, they gone, okay? They are on the outside looking in. They do want to come back in, but there's just no way. Too much time has passed, all right? And they also feel like you don't, they, they're not on your good side anymore. You know what I mean? Whoever this is, they feel like they on the outs with you. Yellow could be here. Somebody could feel like you pulled your energy away and they're very confused by you doing that. You went through some kind of transformation, okay? You also learning a new skill and how to do something. So you could be doing that, all right? Somebody is very religious too, all right? Somebody has strong feelings towards you, Scorpio. They want to tell you that they love you. And um, this person wants to build with you, all right? This person could leave you some kind of note, but they want to build a career with you. They want to focus on you. They want to stand up for you. And they want to come back strong. This is somebody who left you. Roses could be significant and they could be pink. Okay. Ooh. So Scorpio, you might not let this person back. I don't know what's going on. It says unsteady in reverse. So somebody wants to give you something that's more steady. They want to offer you some kind of firm foundation here. All right. Because they have strong feelings for you. I don't know if this has something to do with finances or these feelings. Just this person feel like you could actually help their future. And they really wasn't looking at that at first. But that's not a reason. Like, if this person don't love you, which if they're gone right now, I'm sure they don't. Don't let them back in just because they want to make some money with you, Scorpio. That's fucked up. All right. So, let's get it. <clears throat> what is, how does this person feel about Scorpio? Damn. Why these cards keep falling on the floor, y'all? All right. So, it says they feel like you're dating somebody new. And you took a leap of faith in another direction, okay? So this this person thinks about you and they have feelings for you, but they feel like you took a leap of faith with somebody else and you talking to somebody new and you jumping into new beginnings with new partners, okay? And you're not really focused on them. That's what they feel. And they feel like you're the one for them and you already met the romantic partner you seek. So this person feel like you are their person. You're the one for them. But they thinking that you talking to somebody else and you taking a leap of faith with somebody new, okay? All right, what else does this person think about Scorpio? Whatever, if Scorpio's in no contact with this person, what else do they think? This person also feel like you're really grateful. They're not as grateful. They feel like you're living grateful and you already in your present life attracting what you want, okay? So this person feels like even if they do come back, they're really just messing shit up because you look real happy, <clears throat> You look real happy and it seems like you're peaceful and you're in gratitude. And this person also feels like you've been putting yourself first, focusing on what matters to you. 
all right? <laughs> and you're not interested in talking to nobody who's putting you in a third party, all right? Or who's being not honest, okay? Or who's not making any motherfucking effort, okay? It says make the effort. Love your shadow, all right? So this person just feels like, you know, they're not, they want to be compatible for you, but they weren't. And now they've opened up their eyes and they want to show you who they are because, you know, <clears throat> be aware of co codependency. Avoid behaviors that are affecting your romantic partner. So this person sees things so differently now. You know what I'm saying? It's fucked up now, you know, but they feel like, you know, they have strong feelings for you. They want to tell you. They could be laid up with somebody else at night, but they think about you. They could just be there for a companionship, though. Like, they don't even have the urge to lay with the person or have sex with them. But they just want to be around a feminine energy or be around a male energy, okay? So be careful about being a space filler. Some of y'all know y'all some space fillers, but you don't really care, okay? Um, but yeah, stay in your personal power. People are really recognizing your achievements, okay? And also, people really love you. You bring a lot of joy to them, Scorpio. You bring a lot of joy to the world. And get your nails done. It's important. Love y'all. Bye.